I feel like I've done a lot of satisfactory videos recently. Then again, I've been playing this game a lot. But for this one, I'm actually not going to be sticking around in my base like I usually do. I want to show you guys something that I found while exploring. I'm going to need to use the cannon to do it. Come on. Come on. Give me a good launch. There we go. Because it's... It's a ways out there. Like, I'm going to the other end of the map for this stupid thing. But it's awesome and really, really stupid. So, of course, this is a big map. This is a big game. There's all sorts of stuff out there that... Maybe there was an oversight from the developers when they were building it, and there are occasionally bits and pieces of the landscape that aren't fully done. Which is where I'm going. I have a beacon over there. It's got a strange hole. Because it's a hole in the map, and it's very strange. I'll... I'll it'll... It, It'll be easier for me to just show you guys what I mean, because holes in the geometry of a map is nothing new. Every big game has it. Breath of the Wild has clips in the geometry and places you can go through the rock walls. This has some places exactly like that, where you can just sort of just phase through matter. What is this? Summer Sloop, don't care. I know I should be picking those up, but I really don't care about them. <clears throat> As you can see, I have a bunch. Whoa, what the crap? What am I, what am I clipping into? I have a bunch of jetpack fuel. I'm going to need it. Aye. Stupid freaking toxic gas. Why can't I wear a gas mask and my jetpack? I can see why you can't wear a hazmat suit and a jetpack. But that's your face and your torso. Like, those two pieces of equipment should not impede each other's use. It just seems weird. Alright, and up I go. I'm glad I have it marked with a beacon because this is actually really difficult to find if you don't know what you're looking for. I believe that the way that I found it was I was trying to climb up the vertical cliff and I accidentally stumbled into this area. Oh no. Ow. Dang it. There we go. And up some more. Alright, so if you're trying to climb up, you can use foundations and make temporary platforms for you to recharge your jetpack, which is really useful. I promise, I'm almost there. Here! 
here it is. Alright, so if you're wondering where I am exactly on the map, I am right here. Uh, there's this big open flat area up top on this mesa. There's some sl uh, slopes over here. You just come around, and it's right down in here. And it's just this strange hole. Now, when I first saw this, I thought, oh, there's, there's like a temple or something in here. No, it's just a hole. But wait, there's a hole in this hole. And this second hole, it's deep. This isn't just a hole through the map. This is a hole through the map. I am now underneath the world. Check that out. Oh my goodness, there's the ladder I came down on. It doesn't even reach the bottom. I, I should make it come down here and reach the bottom. Perfect. Like, it's, it's actually really big down here. So... If, for some stupid reason, you want a secret base that's basically impossible to reach and is never going to be able to get resources, ta-da! I wonder if all these little holes I'm seeing down here are also ways in here. I could go check that out. Oh my goodness, grab onto the ladder. It's a long way down. Like, it's so freaking deep. And it's big, too. Like, the space you'd have to work with, it's massive. Not just across, but also vertically. So, yeah, if you want to have secret base... Now you know where to go. The desert is full of these weird little nooks and crannies that you can get lost in. That's not the right term. You can just sort of tuck away. So, yeah, there's... The strange hole in reality. Again, it's bound to happen. I hope that they don't cover it up. Like, that would be amazing. That could be really useful if they ever introduce some sort of, like, PvP or uh, competitive mode. Oh, there is another hole. There are other entrances. Ooh. That could be fun. Fun. Oh, and there's another one. You can drop straight down in. Oh, geez, I fell. Oh, crap. Oh. What? What? Oh, my goodness. This is the best discovery I've made in this game in a long time. Oh, this is fantastic. What about right there? Yup, that's absolutely a place you can fall in. Just make sure you have a jetpack. Because I don't think that Blade Runners or just tanking it is going to do you any good. I wonder if there's more of these entrances. I'm going to look around for them. See if I can find any other big entrances and big openings to big caverns like that. Uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed this. If you did, let me know. And let me know if you actually use this. Ah, crap. Ow. Be careful, the walls are deceptively slippery.
So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. I'm just, I'm just gonna leave the beacon there. <laughs>